You have been going around town, stealing from businesses. You recently stole from the Mafia, and the boss of the Mafia decides to go hunting for you himself. After a lengthy manhunt, he's finally caught up with you and got you all to himself. Will you tell him where you put his money? Hey! Stop right there! Hands up, in the air, drop the bag. Get down on your knees and lay on your stomach. Hands behind your back, now! Okay, we're gonna stand you up. You're being arrested for aggravated robbery. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. Hi. I'm Detective Tingly Tones. I'll be the one interrogating you today. Okay, I'll just be going through normal procedures. First things first is that everything in this room is being recorded. Are you okay with that? Okay, good. So the time and date is Thursday the 25th of November, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Interview started. Okay, so out of all of your robberies, why did you choose this particular jewellery store? You know you robbed huge and popular jewellery stores, art museums, and it's even rumoured you stole from the Mafia. But why did you all of a sudden decide to steal from a small jewellery store? Less chances of us catching you. Well, that didn't work out very well, did it? What was that? I'm not a real detective. What makes you say that? (laughs) For a thief, you sure know a lot about the law and how all this stuff works. To be fair, I didn't do much research before doing this, but... You have to admit, I did do somewhat good job, no? Okay then, well, yeah, you got me. I'm not with the police. Well, I guess now I can take this mask off. So, do you recognize me? (laughs) Oh, you look a little bit scared there for a second there. You thought you had the upper hand, didn't you? Yeah. It's me. I run the Mafia. Let me tell you, you've messed with the wrong people. We've been looking for you for a long time, and now we've finally got you. Don't you play dumb. You know what you did. You stole from us. Now you're going to tell me, where have you put my damn money? Oh yeah, you didn't take it. Bullshit! Tell me where it is. So you're going to play it the hard way, huh? Don't worry, I can play it that way. Where is it? Ah, here it is. The pliers. Can I see your hands real quick? You have very pretty nails. It would be a real shame if I took them off one by one, wouldn't it? What do I mean by that? Well, this is what I mean by that. Yeah, that must have hurt, didn't it? So, 
Do you want to lose another nail? Or are you going to talk now? Oh, well, I have to take another. Oh, no. Slow down. I won't take off another if you just be honest with me and tell me where you hid my money. Is that where it really is? You know, if you're lying, I'll find out. And I'll be forced to really, really hurt you, okay? Well, we'll have to find out first if you're lying or not. So you're going to come with us. Stand up. Come on, we're getting you out of here. And taking you to our camp. And if you really told me the truth about where you hid my money, I might consider letting you leave. I'm just going to put some tape over your mouth, okay? Just in case you get any funny ideas. Boys, let's get them out of here. Well, it's time for you to sleep now. I'm in the chloroform. <laughs> Don't struggle. Take it all in. Breathe it in. There you go. Sweet dreams.